was also struck to see that 75% of the beverage sales are now cold beverages. Mm. And this wasn't even in the height of summer when it's super hot. That's right. Is this a secular change in how people consume coffee? Is this like the new, is this just what it is now that people are going to drink cold coffee year round and that's it? It's definitely uh, skewed more towards a younger consumer. And so we, we, we have a, a large consumer uh, base of millennials and Gen Z, and their taste and preferences tend to be more cold. Now, I'm way over Gen Z, and I love cold espresso. So, But it is definitely an increasing trend, and we don't see it going away. What we are encouraged about in the quarter is that our beverage grew 10%, and that was a combination of growth in both hot and cold. So we did see growth of about 2% weighted on that 10 uh, from a hot perspective, but we also saw cold grow about 8%. So we continue to innovate in both areas so that we can you know, offer coffee um, and, um, and continue to lead in coffee for all of the different customer tastes and profiles, but definitely cold um, is a big opportunity for us, which is why you see us continuing to innovate in areas like ice shake and espresso and refreshment. Um, and even with our new uh, blended lemonade refreshers, those are all areas for us to be able to continue that growth in cold, which not only grows in the morning, but actually has a position across all day parts. So we see a lot of opportunity ahead, but it's definitely not going away. And one investment that got a lot of buzz this past quarter among consumers is those new ice nuggets that you guys are switching over yes. to. How much money do you expect to save at the end of the day with this investment? And what's the response so far? Well, what I'd say is we're in the early journey of what we call our nugget ice. And being able to put nugget ice in our stores, we've hit our highest volume of cold stores so that we can actually support the capacity. And that's largely what the Nugget Ice is about. It's to be able to support the capacity of the cold demand. And so we'll continue to roll out across our stores. Early on, what we're seeing is it's better for partners. Um, it's easier in terms of overall, it blends faster. Um, well, eventually it'll be piped into the stores so they'll no longer have to be you know, carrying buckets of ice. And so it's a better uh, option for the partners and creates a better experience. But at the same time, our customers love it. And so the combination of that you know, gives us confidence that we'll be able to continue to fuel the growth, uh, cold growth that we see you know, with improvements and advancements like Nugget Ice.